Well, re really good win for our team, and you're so proud of them for a number of reasons. One, just to you know be able to bounce back and and get back to work after our last game, and you know we knew that we'd go through some growing pains with a young group, and just to be able to. Uh, play in front of our fans, thank them very, very much because they're very empowering tonight. Um, Loyola is a team that has played um, some really good games, has been really competitive. They got a lot of balance. We knew we were going to have our hands full defensively, but I thought our guys played really, really hard, got the key stops, and then they, they shared it against their pressure to make 14 three-point shots is, is, is really a um, – a special thing to see for our group, and it was spread around. This is a total team effort for us tonight. How would you say, um, how would you analyze the progress made in the second game with Keiston back in the lineup from the first game last Saturday night? So we, we, made, a, we made an adjustment in our rotation um, of getting a little bit smaller. Some of it was to to match up with Loyola, but also to find some different combinations that we thought players would benefit one another. Um, so we got to some different combinations for longer stretches tonight. We, they've played together before. They played together the other night, but we just wanted to get longer stretches. So, um, But I thought the guys did a really good job of finding Keiston. He's got big time range. You know, Some of those threes he shot were from the parking lot, um, but he can stretch the floor like that. And I just think, you know, basketball is is a uh, is so much different than so many other sports because it's free flowing, it's offense and defense, and it just takes a little time for guys to get to know each other. But it was great to see those guys take a step forward tonight.